That's a big branch. Came down from up there somewhere. Alright, let's go check for more storm damage. You guys want to walk with me? Alright, looks like that stuff came out pretty good. Got some brassicas blowing over here. Fix that. Uh, let's see how many onions I lost. There's one snapped clean off. Broken flower head. Wow, these are all leaning over now. Several snapped off here. Oh well. That's life. Let's look over here. Had some trees that the wind tried to rip out of the ground. These were leaning over about 45 degrees. So I had to tie them back vertically again. That one and this one. The rest did pretty fair. Little bitty peach tree. That ought to be huge in a couple of years. Apple trees did good without being staked. This one this one was staked but it let itself loose. But it fared okay. The mulberry still standing. This apple tree doing good. I would have hated to have come out here and seen the way they looked when it was windy. This tree looks like it got hit with a tornado. Got the crick flowing. Look at all that. Blew all the leaves, branches. <laughs> Even stuck in the fence. Where is the drip line on that thing? Wow. My moss. I don't know why. It's just around this tree. Be kind of neat to walk through it barefooted, but uh, fire ants. <laughs> Enough said. <coughs> Excuse me. This right here is why you don't get under this tree. When it's windy. Big old things come down. They're rotten. Well, how am I going to get across here? Not everybody that has one of these in their backyard. Yep. So all in all, with the wind that came through here, we didn't didn't do too bad. It could have been worse. A little bit of damage. Oh, I hope it didn't snap off my okra. Yeah, it might, might stand back up. 
Alright guys, this is a wrap.